Hey folks, if you've ever used strip lights before, you know they look great on the first day and then they end up looking like this. Well, these strip lights from Amaron are the best I've ever used in my life. These are just super easy to get a strip of color, some nice bokeh in the background, or what I use them for is a lot of product photography. My favorite part about the Aperture ecosystem is that you can run everything through one app while you just sit at your desk, you're looking at your monitor, or your phone, you're dialing everything in the way you want it, and the possibilities are endless for the amount of color combinations that you can do with all these lights. And that's where I see these strip lights really coming in handy when you have a little problem area, a little problem corner. You can put these back there, tape them to the back of your bookcase, and then set the color value to match all your other scenes and lighting colors going on. To be able to make everything consistent through one spot, whether it be your iPad or your iPhone, you're walking around, you're seeing everything, and you're able to adjust and dial everything in perfectly. Another thing that blows my mind is that you can just have so many of these Amaron and Aperture fixtures all attached to the Cytus Link. So we are in very lucky times with lighting these days, folks. If you don't want to use the Citus app, there is also just a small controller that this is equipped with. You use that for linking to the Citus app, you can turn it on and off, and you also get into a whole bunch of different effects. Now these effects I cannot find in the Citus app. I think they're all just through the controller. I'll flash them up on the screen so you can see all of these because there's a bunch. And then on top of that, you go into the Citus link and you can find your normal paparazzi, fireworks, cop car, all that stuff. This is also by far the best little controller that I've ever seen for strip lights. Usually it's just something easy, one switch. You have no control over any of it. For 90 bucks now, you're getting something way more useful and I think it's definitely worthy of getting into your kit. So I tried using strip lights to light up a bookcase a long time ago and it just did not work. And so what I mainly use these for is product lighting because you can get some really interesting colors and lines and bands and stuff going on behind and in front of your product. And it's just an easy way to get those nice bokeh dots behind your subject. You can also use these for video product placement and get creative, throw some cotton over these things and now you've got some thunder and lightning clouds going on. You put your product in the middle of this and bang, you got something interesting. It's all up to your creativity with these things. This is just another tool and another way of using light. You get plenty of distance as well, which explains the price. You get about 16-ish feet worth or five meters, and that's packed with 300 RGB smart pixel LEDs. So you don't have to always do this blocky movement stuff. It's got a really nice smoothness when you get it in some of these pulsing type effects and it's got a diffuser along it. So it's not like a hard LED shining at you. One kind of cool, maybe a little gimmicky thing is that you can hook this up to your music and your sound system as well. There's a little microphone built into the controller as well. So you have this next to your sound system. Now the DJ can have their music flashing and pulsing with them, uh, creating kind of a cool effect. They've really tried to pack in as much as they could with this strip light. And that's why I say it is definitely the best strip light on the market right now and definitely worth your 90 bucks. Jumping into the Citus app, you can also get really deep with the pixel control as well, which is pretty fun if you have some color branding you're trying to match. And if you need even more distance, you can buy another five meters or another 16-ish feet, bringing the whole thing up to 32 feet now. So you can easily put it around your whole room and just definitely create a vibe with it if you want. Use different colors for different moods. You can also set this up with Amazon and Google devices using a third party app to get it all set up, but I didn't give that a try because I'm really not an Amazon guy. So if you were looking for the best strip lights, you've definitely found them with these Amaron SM5Cs. Definitely worth checking out and getting them into your kit because there's a lot of cool stuff that'll spark your creativity with these things. If you're already in the Aperture Amaron ecosystem with the Citus Link, I mean, this is a really cool little thing to add into the mix. Light up those shadows and those problem areas that you always want to knock out. And you could easily rig these strip lights to cardboard or any type of shape and create your own LED light panel for 90 bucks. It'll get your feet wet with the Citus app and you'll be able to control everything. It's a really good stepping in point if you are looking for something new in your studio and something fun for your product photography. 
So thanks for checking this out with me, and if you could hit that subscribe button, I would love to keep in touch with you and see you at the next one. Thanks everyone, take care.